What up, YouTube? So, I have been trying to answer all of y'all's questions, all of you people coming into this uh, truck driving journey. That is amazing. And to answer the questions of what am I doing now? Um, I, I don't see the point in documenting something that I've done pretty much. I've done medicine more years out of my careers <laughs> um, than any other, but this is this was a trucking channel. It was a trucking adventure, so I just really don't see the point in showing what it is that I do on a day to day basis. Plus, it's against the law for me to actually like film patients without their permission and all of that jazz. But for um, those of you who've reached out to me on Instagram, wanting to know about what stuff we offer and all of that jazz. Well, I'll turn the camera around and I will show you. So anyways, restroom, office, Starbucks in the parking lot is quite important. So we have an array of machines. This one here is a bunch of laser pads. You turn it on. Each one of these circles is a laser. You put this all over the patient's body, you strap it in. You can leave it on 30 minutes to an hour. What that does is it busts up your fat cells. You urinate or sweat the fat out. Cool thing about fat cells is once you lose them, they don't come back. You don't regenerate fat cells. You can only expand on the ones that you have left over. And so we measure you and all of that jazz. It's not plugged in. We take it to the room. So everything is discreet. EKG stuff, neuro scans. This machine here, you would put your feet down there, your hands. Where's the tray? In here. And this will actually take a picture of your inside of your body and tell you everything that you're allergic to. Normal stuff in here. That bioscan machine is pretty badass, actually. Um, this is all of the stuff for all of our IVs. So we have an IV therapy bar that I run. Here are some people's bags already made up. Um, so I do all of that. Here's our infusion recipes. There you go. Doc's office. So we will come into this room. This room here is primarily for well woman exams. Hence the table and the stirrups and all that stuff we keep put up. So this cool machine right here is one that you've seen me market um, on Instagram and it is the Thermiva. This does vaginal rejuvenation and in doing that it helps not only tighten everything but if you're an older person or you've already gone through menopause like me it keeps everything uh, lubricated. If you deal with dryness, if you deal with low sensitivity, low arousal, it fixes all of that. And it also strengthens your pelvic floor so that you don't pee on yourself, like your bladder doesn't leak. This same machine actually also, I will show you all the wands. So this is what I do on a tape to tape basis. Fix people. So this is the wand for the face part. So it can do face, neck, under your eyes, most people like it really under their eyes, around their frown line, stuff like that. It's radio frequency waves. These little wands get hot. So basically what you're doing is you're causing a traumatic event, renews your cells, renews your collagen because it believes that it has something to fix. These are some patients that have memberships. Those are the grounding pads. Everything is radio frequency waves and energy. So we have to ground you otherwise whenever I put the probe on you or in you, depending on this is, on which uh, procedure you have, it'll shock you. So this is the wand for Thermiva. And when I start, most of the time I measure you beforehand. Yes, that means I do have to go inside of your body, women. Um, but it's really thin. Most people start out right here and by about five or two, five to seven minutes you can only go halfway the tissue starts to respond really really well and things get moving we actually get more calls from the husbands or significant others the the women they can feel that something has changed but the men get the most benefit from it 
So I insert the wand and this tip right here is where the inner, the radio frequency energy goes through and this gets hot. Now, internally we work 20 minutes and basically I just go in and out around the tissue and paying attention to the tissue. I watch it the entire time. We go up in heat um, one degree at a time and that really does make a difference. Um, but it goes up to 115 degrees Fahrenheit. So that is what that machine does. You can get everything light and tight and right with your vagina or your face. All right, so the next room. The next room, we keep kind of dark. So this is our spa room. We have our towels and stuff down there. This is our V-Steam chair. And so I'm gonna open it. All of the stuff that I need to do the V-Steam is in here from our herbs to, look at what I'm still using, my burner, uh, pots, pans, satchels for the herbs. So what this does <clears throat> is I would boil a combination of herbs and the patient sits in here. I put the, you don't leave the hot plate or anything in there. You actually use the bowl. You transfer after the herbs have been boiling, you transfer them into a, the bowl with the hot water and the patient wears a gown that covers their whole body, including the chair, and the steam goes inside the vaginal area. And they sit like that for 30 minutes soaking, letting the, I should say, letting the steam soak them. And it's more spiritual and meditative than anything. You actually are clearing out your root chakra when you do this. And this helps for people that are having um, problems getting pregnant. So if you have some kind of infertility issues, this helps with that. It also helps with uh, people who are women who struggle with a lot of pain during their menstrual cycle. It helps people that have fibroids, endometriosis. It, the steam gets in there, loosens everything up and stuff actually falls out of your insides. It's pretty, pretty cool to see what comes out of everybody. But the spiritual benefit of it is you just kind of imagine that steam going up into your body and taking away all of the toxins and all of that negativity and you just leave it behind. We put a journal in here so people can write if something comes to mind or they, you know, just want to something to jot down. Like people go through so many different experiences whenever you're doing the vaginal steam. So here's where the magic happens, right? The bed. Um, this is where I do this fancy machine, the hydrofacial machine. I'll plug it in because it's really pretty and because we keep this room so dark. So we have my diffuser over here that turns colors and does all kinds of fancy stuff and it shoots lavender. This machine right here does everything. So this is the actual hydrofacial MD edge system. This does a lot of stuff actually. So that's where it holds all of the solutions that we use. We use a glycolic uh, solution to cleanse. We use a, a salicylic acid to exfoliate. And then we use hyaluronic acid and peptides to put back into the face. This is just a cleaning solution for the machine. This is what the machine looks like. So we have the hydrofacial, we have the lymphatic system here that we can um, wipe out light therapy and we can do facial lymphatic. So what is lymphatic? Um, lymphatic is where we hold all of our, this, all of our lymph node systems. And we use these little tubes right here. It's kind of like cupping. So you put, I put my finger over this and you would work up your body. Like um, a lot of people used to, a lot of older people, maybe your grandparents, you've probably seen them do it. They get out of the shower and then they get a brush and they like, hold on, let me turn it around so you can see what I'm doing. So excuse my hair, it's really rainy here in Houston. So anyways, whenever they would get out of the shower, they would get a brush and like do this stroking motion up their body, up their legs and stuff like that moving everything towards your heart. Um, that is what this machine does. I can, so I'll turn this back around so you can see. 
All right, so whenever we hit, say we're gonna do the face. Well, let's do not the face so I can show you the difference. Okay, so these are the different levels of suction. Now it says you only want the vacuum one to three. If you have a patient that's heavier or a patient that, you know, has a lot of tissue to get through, I have control of this. It'll let you know when you're going into like a danger zone. It should, it does on the face. There we go. And then it'll turn red, orange, whatever. So anyways, so why it's changing colors? Because, um, hello, it only wants you to be one to three. There's absolutely no reason you should be trying to take people's skin off. It's not what we do. So anyway, there's bigger ones for the bigger parts of the body. The little one is more for obviously smaller parts. This is the hydrofacial machine, it's, I mean, um, tool itself. It sucks as well as pushes out. And this machine, I mean, this part back here, I just cleaned it out from hydrofacial that I had done. Whenever I'm done, most people anywhere from, I've never seen anybody have nothing, but most people have about 200 cc's of oil, blackheads and whiteheads and everything comes out of your skin via this little thing right here. The different colored edges are just the different things that it does. The different tips do all of these different things, exfoliate, extraction, the application. If you have somebody that you need to be a little bit more aggressive with, if they have really stubborn pores and you, you can see it whenever I'm doing it. Well, I can see it and then I tell the patient. Um, anyways, you would use the orange one to get like the really, really hard stuff deep down in there. And then of course we have like all of our stuff like that. What else does this machine do? Oh, the light therapy. So we can hit that. So we have a red and blue light. I'm trying to turn it on. There we go. Woo. So the blue one just is for people that have oily and like really clogged pores. We use this one more on acne prone skin. And the red one is more for um, anti-aging. So we'll turn on the red one. There we go. So the red one is more for anti-aging. And this I usually do about halfway through. Most people are doing the IV therapy. We have a get up and glow package. Um, they, most people are usually on an IV and asleep whenever I'm doing their facials. So anyways, that <laughs> is the majority of what I do throughout the day, as well as see um, actual clinical medical patients here. Actually, um, I'm fixing to go refill a bunch of prescriptions and make sure that the schedule is going to flow really nicely today. Do something with my hair because it's, this whole woofle thing is just not cute. So anyways, um, that is really it. <laughs> On my day to day, I'm running up and down. Um, I am building up the cosmetic end of this clinic from the ground up. So that's really exciting and fun. And we're just adding more and more stuff cosmetically every day. We do Botox, fillers, uh, everything that's non-invasive, meaning that nothing that's going to cut you open, make you bleed and no surgery. So our doctor, um, I've been a patient of hers for 20 plus years. She's the first doctor I ever worked for out of school. And all these years, 10 years later, I've come back and she has this vision and I'm all about it. Getting people off medications like she did help me get off of mine and using natural, natural things to, you know, anti-aging, um, starting a, starting really, really young on it. My daughter, um, who came home from the Air Force last weekend, she came in here fr before she even went anywhere. My husband took her straight from the airport and brought her here, and I didn't get out of here till 10 o'clock at night, but her skin looks really, really good. Um, we also do the vampire facial, which most people know it as, um, but it's the micro needling pen that stabs you a million times all over your face. Uh, you don't feel it, your face is numb. And uh, I draw your blood, we spin it down, and we put the platelet-rich plasma back into your 
anyways got cut off so anyways we put the plasma back into your skin and then we seal up your pores and most people peel three to five days afterwards and it removes all of the dead skin and your skin is just really really nice glowing it's really really good if you have acne scars if you struggle with acne and if you have any dark spots or aging spots anything like that that's really really um what the prp facial that's the technical term for it um but yeah all kinds of fun stuff so that is the gist of what i am doing these days and um those of you who have reached out on instagram thank you so much i love seeing y'all come in here and being able to help y'all and yeah that's it guys so keep doing what you do and I'm going to try to keep up with the questions and get y'all some answers as quickly as I can. But I am here. I work about 12 to 14 hours a day. Even when I go home, I'm still working, charting and stuff like that. So that is all of the updates for now. And if you have any questions, just reach out and I'll get back to you. Y'all have fun out there and be safe. Peace.